What is up guys, Tabby here and welcome back to my channel. So guys, as you can tell, I have my box from Mist and Magic and guys, look how big this box is. Holy freaking rabies, y'all. I have been so excited for this box. If you guys missed my first unboxing of Mist and Magic, definitely go check it out. I'll try to remember to put that link in the description down below because yeah, I absolutely loved, 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 loved their first box. When they reached out to me asking if I wanted to unbox this box as well on my channel, I was like, yes. Yes, 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 exclamation points times a million. So yes, just to be upfront with you guys, this box was sent to me for free for an honest review on my channel and honest, I will always try to be. So for those who don't know, this is a Harry Potter subscription box. Right now they are not doing monthly subscription boxes. It's more like a special edition box that is a one-time purchase. And this company is actually based in France. So it is an international box. So guys, just keep that in mind. I know we all hate shipping costs and they actually have two different box options. They have the mini box and the maxi box. This is definitely the maxi box. But yeah, y'all, I just want to open this box. So let's do a sneak peek. Oh my gosh. So sneak peek. We got some purple tissue paper. Right on top, we have their business card with all of their information on the back. And I'm assuming this is the spoiler card. The theme for this box was magical shops. So we will save this for last. Look at all of these boxes and stuff. I don't even know where to begin. Wow, okay. Let's go ahead and start with this box that says Venom Antidote for the most potent and deadly serpentine beasts. I'm assuming this is a potion. So it is a potion, but I have to say I am loving the packaging. How they lined the box with this velvet material. Like, that's just amazing. But this is the potion, which is anti-venom serum. And on the back, it says, this serum is in gas form. One breath is enough in most cases. Do not exceed three or it can become lethal. <laughs> that is hilarious. I am loving this bottle. You can actually open it and put liquid in there if you wanted. Honestly, this kind of reminds me of a flask. <laughs> I love this. I definitely think I will be keeping it in the box just because the whole package is just, like that is just amazing. And next we have a really big red pouch. It is a mug and it has different magical shops on there. We have Creatures Bazaar, Apothecary, Sweets and Tricks, Wand Maker, Occult Emporium, and Storm Row Potions. And the picture is just so clear. You can actually make out all of the amazing little details on each of these magical shops. And I actually kind of like that these aren't the magical shops from Harry Potter. It's kind of like Mist and Magic created their own Wizarding World. And I love that. You guys know I love when we get coffee cups, especially Harry Potter ones. I think this might be one of my new favorite coffee cups. Only two items in and I am loving this box. And next we have a notebook that says divination and it even has like a crystal ball on here and on the back. I am loving the design of this, such a cool design. And some of these pages actually have little designs on there. So it looks like this one's like a crystal, I think, maybe. And we have another crystal ball down here. We have some tarot cards. We even have a teacup with some tea leaves in there. Hopefully it doesn't show the grim. Again, that is just awesome. I love all of the extra little details they included in this notebook. And you guys know I love getting notebooks. Such a nice usable item. So yeah, I love this. Next we have a little package here that says souvenir shop, 117 Castle Wind Edinburgh maybe, um, which I think is in Scotland, might be wrong. Oh, it is magical postcards with different designs on there. So we have three of them. And the first one is of a phoenix and it gives us a little information about the phoenix. And the second one is Essence of Euphoria. This compelling elixir has the very special property of bringing unconditional sense of joy and euphoria. It is the perfect remedy for occasional sadness. One must, however, be careful. Too much of this elixir might lead to temporary or in some cases, permanent hysteria. You should not go above five drops at a time. 
depending on the potency of the potion and skills of the potion master. That is hilarious. Kind of like liquid luck, but not exactly. Again, just the detail of this card is gorgeous. I don't know who their artist is, but wow, talent. And last we have ensnaring joy. Ensnaring joy is very recognizable by the heart shape of its leaves. It is a very tenacious plant, mainly used for healing potions. Be very careful when you harvest the leaves. While fresh, its ensnaring power is quite potent. It is advised to boil them first to avoid any sour flavor in your elixirs. I love these. I love the design and the fact that they're postcards that we could actually send to friends or loved ones. Uh, I will definitely not be doing that. I plan on keeping these forever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm such a hoarder. I'm a hoarder of Harry Potter items. So yeah, these are mine. <laughs> and next we have a notepad. And guys, this is not a small notepad. It is a really big notepad and it came with a lot of pages. It has some crystal balls and some cauldrons here for your lists. Has a really cute wand and owl. We can title it like to-do list or wish list, however you wanna title it. I actually have quite a bit of notepads, but I think this is my favorite one that I have ever gotten. I just love the design of this. There is so much you can do with this. I love how you have different sections, different boxes, such a nice usable item. And again, it just feels so magical. And next we have a blue envelope that says Winterdale University of Magic. And on the back, we have a really pretty wax seal with like ribbon to make it kind of look like a bow. It unfolds to like all these different sections but it says, Dear Applicant, thank you for your application to study advanced magic at Winterdale University. We are delighted to inform you of your admission to the above degree program commencing September 2020. As the leading research university to, in terms of magical studies and advanced magic theory, Winterdale University is committed to giving you the very best education available. The academic and personal accomplishments you have already achieved within your school and community reflect what we value, respect, and expect in our students. Ambition, compassion, and curious intellect are at the heart of Winterdale University. Your train and ferry tickets are enclosed below, and we hope to see you on campus for our summer reception program. You will receive a formal invitation to these events as well as the details of your course in our next letter. If you have any inquiries, please contact the undergraduate admission office. Oh my gosh, this honestly feels like a college acceptance letter. Like we just graduated Hogwarts and we're going to college. Like I'm 31 years old, but can I go? I would go back to college if it was Winterdale University of Magic. But guys, right down here, we really do have our ferry and train tickets. So this is the first one that says, for one single journey, Edinburgh to Applecross from Scotland Railways. And this is the next one. I'm loving the gold. Hobbridge, I, I don't know what that word is. Ferry Company, one passage between Applecross and Winterdale. Oh my gosh, wow, okay. Right here we have the supply list that shows all of the supplies we need and the different classes we will be taking, which is spells and rituals, herbology and potion making, divination, astrology, magic zoology, and then all of the books we need. And over on this side, we have an actual map of Scotland and it even shows Winterdale on there and the train route from Edinburgh. And at the very bottom, it has the timetables for Scotland Railways and the ferry company. I love this. Again, just the imagination and thought and details that went into this and just how Mist and Magic has kind of created their own wizarding world and their own wizarding university. Like, yes, 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 yes. I for real want to go to Winterdale University of Magic. And next we have a really big package. Y'all, it is a potion kit. Norland's Apothecary, 15 Castle Wine, Edinburgh, Scotland. This looks so authentic to the Wizarding World. It actually has tons of different potions in here. And it has a list of the potions up here. And it says essential kit for most common brews and potions. Oh my gosh, there are like four different packages here. So this is the first one that says dried lavender buds. 
I'm not gonna untie it, but you can see the lavender buds in there. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, next we have this one. And this one is Gold Butcher's Broom Leaves. And guys, it is actual gold leaves in there. I cannot get over how amazing this is. Next we have Cockatrice Eggs. I don't think I said that right. These enchanted eggs will keep their properties and stay fresh for years. Reduce eggshell to thin powder before adding it to your potions. And we have a little dragon sticker on top. So I'm assuming this is like some type of dragon egg. And y'all, it is actual little eggs in here. We have two of them. I, uh, I have no words, y'all. I have no words. And the last potion in our potion kit. Oh, it's two of them. Oh, these are so pretty. The first one here is crystallized dragon blood. And it has crystals in there with like this orange sparkly kind of liquid. And the next one is Sleeping Drought Base Formula number 7132. Looks like it has a bunch of different leaves and like these little crystals. Like how freaking amazing is this? So authentic to the Wizarding World. I have gotten a lot of different potions in subscription boxes, but I have never gotten a full potion kit. I don't, I, I have no more words. I literally can't talk. Next, we have a little folder here that says Enchanted Parchment Letter Writing Set. It is actual like stationery. So we got a bunch of different envelopes and quite a bit of parchment to where we can actually write letters and send it to people. We also have stamps. Oh my God, they think of everything. So we have a Time Turner stamp. Oh, we have the dragon egg stamp. This is actually the poster design from their first box. We have one here that says spells with some wands on there. We have this one as well, which was the other poster design from their first box. And a hippogriff, which I do believe was the cup design from their first box. And I just love this little folder we have that keeps all of our stationery in there. I have actually been wanting to get some Harry Potter stationery. So this is just perfection. Per Perfection, guys. I actually have a P.O. box which is in the description down below. So guys, if any of you end up writing me, I will write you back and your envelope will have one of these amazing stamps on there. And last but certainly not least, I do believe we got some more posters. There isn't just one, there are three of these. So this is the very first one, Sweets and Tricks, kind of like Honey Dupes, Choco Salamander, Ghost Breath, Dragon Eggs, Frosty Bites, Sugar Pumpkin. Wow. Mist and Magic, I don't know who your artist is, but they are so talented. Oh, I will definitely, definitely be hanging this on my wall. And this is the next one, the Ashbourne Wand. And then it gives us some details about the wand. That is so pretty. Wow. I'm not gonna read it all because this video is gonna be so long, but as always, I'll try to include videos and pictures and stuff of all of the items. And the last one. Holy gold foiling rabies. Oh my God. That is just gorgeous. So this says constellations of the northern sky and it's kind of like your zodiac sign. So mine is actually the phoenix, which is independent, brave, assertive, and impulsive. Eh. I'm very independent. I am definitely impulsive, especially when it comes to buying Harry Potter stuff. Uh, assertive though, I'm not very assertive. <laughs> So yeah, they have White Stag, Phoenix, Kelpie, Manticore, Basilisk, Direwolf, Hippogriff, Sea Serpent, and Raven. Y'all, I cannot get over how gorgeous this is. I adore this beyond words. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That was everything from the box. Let's take a quick look at our spoiler card just to make sure I didn't miss anything. So overall, it's saying we got 11 items, but again, it's not including those five potions in our potion kit. And it's just the postcard set. Again, we got three of those. 
So we have a little information on every single item. The Winterdale University of Magic that also had our travel tickets, a map of the area, an official supply list of everything you need to start your magical studies. And then we had the wand maker shop poster, the anti-venom potion presented in a beautiful velvet box. This potion is an essential for all magic zoologists and will protect them from dragon or sea serpent bites. Storm Crow has been known for their potion making mastery for hundreds of years and venom antidotes are one of their specialty. Again, I love that Mist and Magic has created their own magical world. And next we had the potion kit that contains the two cockatrice eggs, the vial of crystallized dragon blood, the bottle of gold butcher brooms leaves, the pouch of dried lavender buds, vial of sleeping draft base formula. Then we had the gorgeous constellation poster. Ortalis is the most famous map maker of enchanted maps. That's magic guys. I truly believe that is magic. With its velvety texture. Oh, I didn't even feel it. It is velvety. Oh, and gold foil. This luxurious map is beautiful, is a beautiful collector's item. Symbols of the astrological signs, the northern constellations have been hand drawn amongst the stars. This northern sky map has also been enchanted to orient itself as soon as you step outside under the night sky. Oh, amazing, amazing, amazing. And then we had the sweets and tricks poster. Do not forget to stop by the most magical sweet shop in Edinburgh for a little sugary treat. And then last was the divination notebook. This notebook is an essential tool in your path toward unveiling your future. A trusted companion in your walk of discovery where you'll be able to record all your insights into the misty magical future. Oh wait, no, that wasn't it, just kidding. And then we had our letter writing set. Keep in touch with your fellow witches and wizards thanks to this wonderful letter letter writing set. Then we have the to-do list notepad. Set your goals and tasks for the day with this magical notepad. Each pad contains multiple sections for important events, favorite potion recipes, or things to remember, as well as check off lists so you don't forget anything ever again. Then we have the magical shops mug. Last but not least, be sure to pop into your souvenir shop to grab some memento of your visit in the magical street of Edinburgh. This magical shop ceramic mug is dishwasher and microwave safe, which is always important. And then last, we had our postcard set. And don't forget to bring some magic to your family and friends with this set of lovely postcards. Um, but we also did have a little note that fell out of here. It says, we are sorry to announce that we were not able to include the Phoenix wax seals in the stationary set. They have unfortunately been jinxed by mistake to make any envelope invisible once stuck on it, which is quite unfortunate. <laughs> we were not able to reverse the jinx in time to ship the boxes, so please accept our apologies for this inconvenience. That's actually really nice that they even told us that the box was missing an item because yeah, they really didn't have to tell us. It's unfortunate that they got jinxed, but honestly, I don't even care. This box, you guys, was phenomenal. Just the quality, the detail, the originality, the thought, the imagination, the imagination that went into this box. Because guys, this was not the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. This was a brand new Wizarding World and I really wanna go there. I'm not sure if this box is already sold out or if it's still available, but guys, definitely go follow Mist and Magic on Instagram so you will be notified when they have new boxes available. Again, for now, they're doing one-time special edition kind of boxes. It is not a month-to-month -month subscription box. And guys, you do not want to miss these boxes. <sighs> wow. I, 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 I. As always, you guys will have to let me know what was your favorite item, least favorite. Well, I definitely did not have a least favorite item. Favorite item? Ooh, um, I honestly don't know, guys. I loved everything in this box. I mean, the Constellation poster is definitely up there, but I also really loved the potion kit, my acceptance letter to Winterdale University of Magic. I never thought I would say I wanted to go back to college, but I mean, I loved everything. Everything in this box was just amazing. Thank you so much, Mist and Magic, for sending this to me. This really is one of my favorite Harry Potter subscription boxes. And I get a lot of boxes, but this one to me, is it the best? 
is it? But as always, I would love to hear from you guys in the comments down below. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, hey, welcome. Feel free to hit that subscribe button if you want to join my small community of Harry Potter lovers and bookworms. And I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys. I got... Are you done, Kit Kat? First... What am I trying to do? It's more sorry, I was starving and yeah, I had to eat. My hands were shaking, I was so hungry. Wow. Get the food off your mouth, Tapta. <laughs> a compliment. Accomplishments. <gasps> Cock of what? Parchment paper. Y'all could probably play a drinking game to how many times I've said amazing. Y'all, I was about to take my thumbnail picture with all the items back there. I'm so smart.